still use water bottles. Okay, make it nice and easy. Sit down, Alfie, you're gonna join us here and you're gonna bring up those two weights to start off with. Okay, so what we're gonna do is just get that heart rate up a little bit. We're gonna march on the spot, just holding those weights in the hand. That's it, you can have them down by your side. For a little bit more resistance, you can bring them up here to the top. So that's it, we're gonna get some cardio in as well, strength training so that we are burning lots of calories feeling amazing and getting sweaty. So make sure that you hashtag, I can feel the burn Rebecca after you've done this workout. And of course, Ralphie's our community name. Okay, we're gonna move with our arms. That's it, so just taking it up and then all the way to the top of the head. That's it, taking it down, squeeze all the way up. Really make sure that those abs are tucked in and bring it up to the top and squeeze. Give me a smile. You're gonna smile the whole way through this workout even if it's painful, even if you're feeling that burn, I want you to keep on moving. Yes, okay, we're gonna take it out to the side, bring it in together. I told you guys, we're gonna tackle those arms, the shoulders, you're gonna get a whole full body workout in this next 15 minutes. And if you have not already joined the 30 Day Get Fit Plan, it's amazing, you're gonna get a different workout every day, it's 30 to 40 minutes long, and you are gonna feel the burn, you get recipes, a print off calendar, the whole video playlist, everything that you need to help you get amazing results. Okay, hold these out to the side, and we're gonna pulse for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, back in together. That's it, keep those hips tucked underneath, making sure that you're not really overextending those shoulders, keeping everything nice and tight and in control. And you're ready to pulse for 10, Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna take it back to the top. So those marching on the spot and bringing those arms in here. We're gonna get through this workout. We're gonna feel amazing. Just stick with me, do as much as you can. If you need to take a five second break, just breathe in and out and then come and join me again. That's it, so arms up, holding onto those weights or drop them down to the side if you need to. Okay, you ready for that next set in three, Two, one, okay, arms in and over the top of the head. Squeeze it down. We're gonna take it nice and slow this time. So push up to the ceiling and then take it down. So those palms are facing up, bring it to your shoulders and then squeeze up to the ceiling. That's it, nice and slow. We're gonna mix it up with doing fast reps, slow reps, so if you need to move your weights around as well, depending on you know what your resistance is, you can do that as well. And if you have not increased your weight, in the last, I want to say, two months, I think it's time that you increase that weight. That's where we're going to get those extra results kicking in. You're going to start to really push your body and increase that muscle mass. Okay, three, two, and one. Okay, we're taking it out to the side and back in. So squeezing those arms together. That's it, keep that chest up. And we're going to pulse for the last 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, you can put those weights down. We're just gonna hold on to one weight. We're gonna work those legs. So grab hold of that weight, okay, in one hand. And you can use two if you need to use extra resistance. You can grab both. And all you're gonna do is you're gonna curtsy, okay, and then kick out to the side. So keeping that chest up and then kick. Woo, so here we are, we're working those glutes, we're working those leg muscles, we're even getting an arm workout and engaging that core. So every single move that we're doing, we're literally using our whole body, so we're getting a full body tone, yes. Okay, let's see if we can get a little bit lower, and then squeeze those glutes as you get to the top. So as you extend that leg, push up in that supporting leg, and then squeeze. So as you go down, press into that heel, and lift up. Good job, everyone. We've got five, four, three, two, and one, let's take it over to the other side. So down we go. Think about just kind of going backwards rather than too much on the diagonal, keeping that chest up, lifting those arms, and then just kicking that leg out to the side and pushing down into that supporting heel. So as you stand up, push into that supporting heel and squeeze those glutes as you get to the top. That is what's gonna make sure that you're maximizing the movement, Whew, and getting everything out of each exercise. Okay, we have got five, four, Chest up, three, two, and one. Okay, great job, next exercise. We're gonna have that weight just how we were, but we're gonna hang it the other side. You have got 10 minutes left to go, we're five minutes in already. We're gonna squeeze those weights as you get to the top. So really push 
push that booty back and those knees out towards the side. Keep that chest up and use that weight as resistance. Oh, how are you feeling everybody? You guys are doing incredible. Just think, 10 minutes. What are you gonna do for the next 10 minutes? Are you going to keep doing this workout and get results? Or are you gonna stop and probably just flick around on your phone, walk around your house and not really do much? You can maximize your time right now by getting this workout in and finishing it all the way to the end. Keep that chest up and squeeze. We've got three and two. And one, okay, we're gonna go down to the ground. So shake out those legs, take it down to the ground. We're gonna grab both weights, and we're gonna extend those legs out in front. And we're gonna slowly bring those knees in and extend those arms out. Now you can put those weights down for a modified version and have your arms out here. If you wanna increase it and challenge yourself, just extend and bring back in. Woo! Oh my goodness, guys, I can feel the burn. If you can feel it too, then make sure that you hashtag I can feel the burn Rebecca and you hashtag our community name Ralphies. Oh yes, all the details are in the description below. So keep squeezing, keep working with us. We're all doing this together. We're on the same journey. And we're going to extend out and hold for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. And again, in. Extend. You see, really keeping those arms nice and straight and extending those legs all the way out to the end. Woo, this is the second set, guys. Come on, stay strong. How much do you want it? And remember that 80% is nutrition and 20% is fitness. So if you're not eating the right foods, you're never going to get those results that you want. So make sure you check out my nutrition plan that's going to give you all the right post recovery, the things to have before you work out, afterwards, and everything out through the day. We're going to hold for the last time. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, smile, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, relax down. We're going to flip one over. We're going to hold on to those weights. They're going to be directly underneath our shoulders. So push up and hold that plank for me. Okay, what we're going to do is one knee at a time, come down to the ground. So squeeze those hips underneath and then touch the knee one at a time. We're working those arms, we're working those abs, and we're keeping everything nice and controlled. Now breathe in and smile. You've got this, guys, for 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Okay, you're going to stay down here on your knee. You're going to bring one weight behind, and we're going to go into fire hydrant. So hand directly underneath. You're going to flex that foot. Squeeze the weight behind your knee and then you extend it out to the side. So just lift it up, you're keeping everything else nice and still. So push down into those hands and then lift up that knee and squeeze those glutes. How are we feeling guys? Are you going to quit now? Nope, you're going to keep going because those results are at the end. That's it, now we're going to lift it up here and hold. That's it, just breathe in. And breathe out. I know you can feel that burn, but just keep on pushing through. And let's go into that second set. Squeeze it out to the side. And really think about having your arms nice and straight in front of you, keeping that back still. And let's lift it up and hold for the last five, four, three, two, one. Okay, take it down. We've got to do exactly the same on the other side. So really squeeze that weight behind your knee and flex that foot. Lift up and let's take it out to the side. Now really try and keep your hips in line. We don't want to move everything. We just want to really push down into the ground and then lift up that knee to the side. Oh my goodness, guys, you are doing incredible. Do not quit now. Your results that I see every single day on Instagram and Facebook at Rebecca Louise Fitness are so amazing. You guys who have just joined our community, you're going to get incredible results too. You've just got to keep on sticking with it. And let's hold up to the top. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, and let's go again. We've got five minutes left to go, guys. That's no time at all. You can make this happen. And we're gonna squeeze. That's it. The last time we're gonna hold it at the top in three, two, one. All the way up to the top. Hold here, guys. Come on, lift up that knee a little bit higher. And squeeze for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, relax it down. You're gonna grab those weights, we're gonna stand back up to the top. So we keep moving around. Oh yes, we are sweating, we're feeling amazing. Okay, you're gonna hold 
hold on to these two weights and we're going to sway from side to side. So holding those weights in the hands and we're going to work on those inside thighs. So chest is up and that booty is going back. So squeeze as you get to the top. That's it. Really push that knee out to the side and sit back into that into those hips. Okay, sit back into that chair. Now we're going to hold over to this side for five, four, three, two, one. Take it over to the other side and hold for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, last set. Really push that butt back. Oh yes, you're going to work those inside thighs. Woo! Working those calf muscles and getting our heart rate up. We've got five, four, three, two, one. Okay, bring those feet together. We're gonna drop those weights to the side. And all we're gonna do is gonna lift up onto those toes and down. So working those calf muscles, that lower leg, really smooth. It might look like a really small exercise, but guess what guys, after we've done about 10 of these, you're gonna really start to feel that burn. So that's it, just rolling up gently onto the balls of those feet having those weights down the side, and then lift up, squeezing those abs, tuck in deeply under, and we're gonna hold it at the top for five, four, three, two, one. Okay, now bend those knees. Oh yes, we're gonna pulse for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Now all the way up to the top. Last set, guys, come on. You want those strong, sexy legs. Let's keep pushing to the end. You're gonna go up nice and slowly all the way to the top. And we're gonna hold here. Tuck those hips underneath, squeeze nice and tight, and then bend down. Oh yes, we're working that core, we're working those calves, and let's pulse for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna take it back down to the ground to work on those abs. So you have those weights down here, you're gonna push right up, and we're gonna work those abs and the arms at the same time. So we're gonna squeeze in, alternate it, bring that weight in towards the chest. Keep everything else nice and still. <sighs> Breathe in and out. And let's go, guys. Come on, we're on the home straight. We can finish this strong. However you start it, I want you to reset your brain. Reset your brain and say, this is how I'm gonna be doing the rest of my workout, just how I started. Okay, we're gonna lift it up and hold for 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. Come on guys, three, two, one. Take it over to the other side. And let's go for five, four, three, two, one. Second time, five, four, three, two, one. Okay, we're gonna roll onto the back. We're gonna just grab one weight. And you're gonna put that weight over the top of your head. And you're gonna roll all the way up. So you're gonna squeeze, you're gonna extend your leg, and then take it down. Okay, so nice and slow, bring it all the way up, extend those legs to the top, touch those feet down, and then squeeze back. That's it, you can use that weight to help push you up, squeeze those abs in as you lift those legs, and then bring it down. Oh my goodness, guys, you are doing so great. Keep it going, are you sweating? We have got 60 seconds left to go, that is nothing, okay? We're gonna work these abs until the end. Remember though, abs are made in the kitchen, so making sure that you have that right post-recovery shake afterwards is gonna get you those great results. Okay, who is ready to finish this workout? But who's gonna finish it strong? We're gonna lift up. I'm gonna do 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Now flutter those legs. That's it, keep everything nice and straight. We are so close to finishing, guys. You are doing incredible. Just keep moving those legs. Drop that weight if you need to. We're gonna go into the last 10 seconds. Are you ready? And let's go for 10, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Bonus hold, arms up to the top and squeeze. Three, two, one. Oh, and now you can relax those weights, relax the legs down and gently come up to standing. Now make sure that you have done the cool down video afterwards. We do have a warm up video as well, exclusively on the 30 day get fit plan. Make sure you hashtag I can feel better and better. 